Good evening, welcome. Just a quick short video. Um, there's a few people about on the Uflow website or people that own these kegs or similar kegs to these having trouble getting the coupler on top of the fitting there. Uh, so you need to get that onto there, which is for the beer, it goes on top. Now I've already got the gas one fitted on there. So if we can come in closer, a couple of people are trying to get that fitting onto there. And I must admit, initially I had the same trouble. Now it's not like a hose pipe, it's not like a quick fit fitting, it doesn't just click, click, click easily. You've got to ease it in. You can't be rough with it. You've got to show it a little bit of love, a little bit of love and care and attention. Let me just show the way I do it. Now what you've got to remember is, if you look in the top there, you've got a small pin there. Okay. That's like, sort of like sprung loaded, or it may be under pressure. So that needs to be eased in. On the other end there, there's your fit in there. You can't just whack that on, you need to ease it on slowly. If you, that's, the knack is to ease it on slowly. So what you do, you pull that back. That should pull back. So the knack is to pull that sleeve back and then ease it on. Now, if I can bring this round. So the key is there. Let me bring the camera in. But I'm gonna try and do this one handed. So the key is, you got a pin in there and the rubber seal. Obviously it's got to be very tight. And you got a pin inside there. That pin has to push that pin in. So it's not a case of just whack it on really quickly. You have to ease this back like so. And then line it up, push it on very, let me just get that out of the way. Okay, line it up, push it on very slowly. There you go. That's nearly on, one more push. Oh, I can't do it one hand. There we go, hang on. Hopefully you can see this. I went to that position there. There you go. On. That's nice and snug. Hopefully you saw that. Let me do that once more. So I take it off, you pull that ring back. Just slide it off gently and slowly. There you go. Right, let's try it again. One more time. So you've got this rubber seal, the pin. You won't be able to whack that in just really quickly because there's a pin in there and a pin in there which pushes that back. So you pull that back, nice and straight, pull that back, easy on like that, there you go. Okay, and that is on, solid. Done. Right, I hope that's helped you, a uh, few people out there, if you watch that, just a quick rough and ready video. The key is to pull this back, pull that sleeve back, and then ease it on. Okay, it won't just go click click. It's not a hose pipe. It's not like an easy, easy fitting. As I say, you've got a pin in there, which is sprung loaded or under pressure. I think that's sprung loaded. And then you've got a pin in there, which needs to push that in. So that the knack is to, again, B for beer, so that goes on the top. So let me try and do it one more time. The knack is to pull this back, like so. Push it on nice and vertical. Easy on, there you go. It's nearly there, and when it's like that, there you go, done. There's a knack to it, it's gotta be tight, you don't think leaking out. Um, it's a knack. Don't force it, a little bit of love and care. Enjoy your beer. I've got loads more videos on my channel. Uh, we've got the Uflow keg, homebrew, pubs, sheds, etc., garden bars, etc., etc. So if you're interested in any of that stuff at all, um, please like, subscribe, click subscribe, click like, and I'll see you again in another video. Thank you very much, bye-bye, cheers.